What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video and today we are going to look at the Genome Aggregation Database, also known as NOMAD. The Genome Aggregation Database Consortium presents a catalog of human genetic variation on unprecedented scale. As a successor of Exome Aggregation Consortium, which focuses on exome sequence data for around 60,000 individuals and identified 7.4 million small genetic variants encoding regions. Whereas NOMAD includes genetic variation for around 15,000 whole genome in addition to 125,000 exomes. The increase in sample size and inclusion of known coding regions add more than 240 million small genetic variation as well as structural variations. So let's get into the NOMAD database. First, we have to search for NOMAD on Google. G NOMAD. Now we have to click on the first website, which is hosted by broadinstitute.org. This is the main page of NOMAD website. And here we have to search for our gene of interest or region or variant. Here we search for the gene, for example, VEGFA. Here you go. So this is the results. It shows the name of gene and the genome build, which is HG19, and ensemble gene ID, and ensemble transcript ID, and other transcript IDs, and the region on the chromosome, which is uh, on chromosome number six, from this position to this position, and some external resources. Here are the constraints of synonymous, non-synonymous. This shows the mean depth of coverage per base. And this shows the transcripts. This is coding region. And those are non-coding regions. This shows the tissues. And this is the results of ClinVar. On, the, on that region, they have some variant which is also reported on ClinVar. These are the variants on Nomad database. And here are the variants which is shown in the table below. And here are the variants of this gene. The first thing is the ID source, HGVS consequences, and web annotation, law and clinical significance, which is reported in ClinVar database, with some flags, and allele count of each variant, allele number of each variant, and allele frequency of each variant. And you can also download these variants in CVS file like this. After downloading, you have the list of all the variants which is present in your gene of interest. And This also shows the frequency or LE number of those variants in different populations. For example, LE count in Africans. Latino, admixed Americans, East Asians, and all the other populations which is included in NOMAD. So that's it for today's topic. And you can also search for the variants and as well as particular regions on that website. 
So see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.